Marvel and Netmarble also launched, um, was it Marvel Revolution? Mm-hmm. Um, it's going to be an MMO um, releasing out to mobile. Um, Future Revolution. It looks like a pretty cool game. I'm very excited. I was surprised because I, I'll use air quotes, pre-ordered. Mm-hmm. Um, and by pre-ordered, I mean, like I clicked the pre-order button in the app store and it automatically downloaded. I got all excited this morning when I went and it was already on my devices launching it. Um, So a 1.7 gig download, then download an additional four gig on my iPad um, to in which I was then notified. And I'm looking at the timer countdown right now. Um, You do all of that and then you get time remaining Eight hours and 44 minutes, 24 seconds till Mm. you can play. Um, They do have a fun little um, Flappy Bird style um, game to play as Star-Lord to fly through while those downloads are updating. I thought it was a pretty cool way to to keep you engaged while you're watching the progress bar. Um, But looking forward to this game in about another nine hours. So what kind of game is it? Like, so... It's calling it a fir- the first open world action RPG on mobile. So is this like a Fortnite esque kind of look? I mean, like I'm trying to find like actual screenshots of it. Like I'm not. I mean, this is obviously a very CG trailer that's going on here that we've been looking at, right? So yeah, and, like, and I haven't seen much actual gameplay footage. So I'm yeah. interested to see how it plays because is it going to be like level up t- type stuff? The cool thing. And and I I saw I saw this kept me going on oh, well, well, here, Pokemon Unite. Well, well, um, they're doing check in gifts. Okay. So okay, um, you check in within the first seven days, you get a four star costume box. You check in, in within the the fourteen, Jeez. the next the next seven, you get some crystals, and then with the twenty eighth day check in, um, you get a five star costume box. The pretty cool thing. It looks like they're they could be tying into um, kind of the multiverse because there's numerous costumes for your character that kind of mm-hmm. look like they would loosely match up mm-hmm. with all of the different versions of like Iron Man, Spider Man, etc. Um, so I'm, I'm interested. Like I said, I, I haven't seen actual gameplay footage. But I'm I'm looking forward to giving it a whirl. I've really liked a lot of the other Marvel games. Um, they can keep my interest for a pretty decent period of time. Um, so see what this one's like. It goes. Uh, I I wish I'm looking at it. So I, I'm starting the, the initial download now uh, from the App Store. Um, sadly, it's not on. I, I don't know. I'm looking at this because I just upgraded my Apple TV because I needed a second. I, I upgraded the living room because I needed a second one. I don't know if you're here when that happened, Chilla um because of yeah because we were talking about your pictures that pop up on the old one you gave me mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah that i can't use um I, i'm always looking like please can this game be on apple tv as well since i have a nice you know nice going one um but uh, yeah so it's iphone ipad only um so and it launches tomorrow ish so it's like 3 a.m in the morning or something oh i'll be the, up i'll be finishing the, the shows by then i'll be fine you know, well, we'll stay up another couple hours playing this thing, maybe. So, uh, friend me on there. I haven't done like one of these free medium things in it. I have, I have a feeling one plays for like ten minutes and get annoyed. But uh, we'll give it a shot. We'll give it a shot. It looks cool. It actually does look cool. So, 